So the crazy thing is, I was looking at this last night, and I was like, man, this is definitely going to happen. Like, this is <laughs> it's going to happen. And I was just thinking about it, and it literally happened. Well, it, it, wasn't, it wasn't last night, it was the other night, right before they released the new unit. So if you didn't know, a couple days ago, Grand Summoners JP announced that they're bringing in another super... <laughs> They're bringing in another Super Oroken unit, right? This character is a tank character that has a damage barrier on the True Arts for 35,000 damage, okay? He redirects all allies' damage taken to self, and that barrier is uh, negates damage for himself, by the way. Then, going to the Super Arts, of course, redirects all allies' damage taken to self and gain a damage barrier that negates 5,000... 50. That negates 50,000 damage to self. So he's a part of the ninja saga. Technically, he has third eye. Um, so, which meaning, um, going to that third eye with the super true Rs, he removes two damage resistance down debuffs from himself. Also, this character gets 50 art gauge at the beginning of the quest. And again, more abilities right here to buff up humans. I mean, human meta, what I'm telling you. But see, with the thing this is happening with Finn doing the damage he, you know, that he can do and have the abilities and the equipment and, you know, these all these stats for him to be able to operate at, in this new super awoken form, which means he's clearing content, that content that's in the game right now that is, you know, fairly easy. But see, this is where the change is about to come in for Grand Summoners just because with them adding a new awakening system, a new level up system and everything like that. It's gonna bring in harder content in the game. Grand Summoners, content wise, PVE wise, is going to be harder. And uh, I'm, I'm excited for that. I'm excited for it to be harder. But I knew, I knew once they dropped the fin, they was gonna just keep on going, keep on going. Now, now I do not think they should release like a lot of super awoken units um this fast until they get you know multiple events multiple content that's out there that you know that's like harder so you can you need those units you know what i'm saying i wouldn't say need but if you have those units the fight would be you know faster easier better probably more interesting you never know i do like the new awakening system and everything like that uh it's pretty interesting especially when you can switch in the equipments that this guy right here has a six star physical a five star uh, shield four star shield or you switch to a four star heal then when it came to third eyes when it came to you know uh, demonic true eclipse and everything like that magia drive then going to the phantom bullet a lot of units and more sagas that they release a lot of units you know coming from grand summoners they're gonna have that there i guess it's just a, a thing that they really like to do and that's gonna be one thing that they uh have of course they're gonna switch it up for different units in the game and everything like that but don't be surprised if you don't see, you know, Super Arts, you know, Third Eyes, you know, something above the True Arts level and everything. And something to activate the True Arts level to get, you know, better stats and abilities. This is not bad that they're adding a whole new Awakening and everything like that. This is good. This is definitely good. It brings more content into the game. But they're going to need to, they're going to have to just, you know add harder content or the game is just gonna be easy <laughs> unless they want the game to be easy which i highly doubt that they want that so i'm pretty sure they're gonna be adding a whole bunch of stuff when it comes to events raids mines maybe we even get a new game mode that this can possibly lead to hopefully overall i'm excited for the stuff that i'm hoping to come to grand summoners i'm just not excited for them to release you know multiple units like this and don't let these units to be you know super awakening unless it comes to like a a natural state where every unit is super awake awoken so crossover units will be super awakened and everything like that so we're gonna see what they're gonna do with this um we're gonna see how they take it if only special units can be super awakened and everything like that or what they're gonna do or would they just super awaken their units you know over time like how they did with the regular awakenings for the five stars so yeah this is the new character in the comments down below let me know how you feel about this new character coming to jp we have a lot of stuff coming to grand summoner so be ready for that it's me boy sleepy snake have an amazing day and stay sleepy